Hi, in this video, I just like uh, to show you, you know, uh, several methods on how uh, you know you could actually identify you know what are the products that people are actually searching for, and you know they they really want to purchase online. All right, uh, it is a bit different from what you know you could have seen other people teach about. All right. We're gonna make use of the Google Keyword Tool. Okay, so uh, for those of you who have never heard of the Google Keyword Tool, uh, is is a free keyword research tool provided by Google, and it's extremely powerful. Okay, so uh, you could just go to Google.com and type in Google Keyword Tool and uh, search for it, and just click on the first result, and that will bring you to uh, the Google Keyword Tool. So right now, uh, I'm here. All right, so. Um, before I start off, just want to give you a very quick tip first. Okay, so let's say if you're searching for uh, keywords which are related to insurance, okay, and you click on uh, the search button, okay, uh, if you were to scroll all the way down, okay, uh, you notice that uh, they will only show you a maximum of 100 results, okay. Now, uh, I'm not sure if you're aware of this, alright, but if you if you have a Google AdWords account, which is also free to sign up, okay, and you actually, you know, uh, sign in to your Google AdWords account, all right, Google, the Google Keyword Tool will actually show you a lot more search results, and if I'm not wrong, it's up to uh, 800 searches, okay, and I'm sure that a lot of you might not even be aware of this, so let me just do a quick search right now. Okay, same keyword insurance. Okay, so let me scroll down right now, and you will see that there's a total of 657 results as compared to the earlier search, which only produced 100 results. And remember, uh, I searched for the exact same keyword phrase and uh, which is insurance right so th that's the only um, difference okay so just by logging into my Google AdWords account uh, I'll get a lot more keywords okay so uh, if you do not have a Google AdWords account no, just just sign up for one it's totally free even if you do not use it to advertise on Google AdWords you know uh, it doesn't matter at least it, it, it will help you produce a lot more keyword results okay so um, Right now, I'm going to dive straight into the method. All right, I'll be revealing a few methods uh, on how you could actually find, uh, you could actually really identify what are the products that people are really searching for. Okay, so, um, so uh, you have to understand um, the psychology behind uh, you know, people when they are, you know, uh, searching for products and reviewing products. Okay, so uh, let's just imagine. Okay, if someone were to chance upon a new um, weight loss product, okay, and uh, okay, so what what are the things that people actually search on Google for? Okay, uh, okay, they would want to find out if does the product. Let's just call it uh, ABC weight loss product. They want to find out uh, does it really work? Okay, so what would they actually search for on Google? Chances are they will search for does ABC product work? And they will search for uh, the exact search phrase, this exact search, search phrase, on Google. Okay, and they want to read, you know, what are some of the opinions or reviews that have been provided by other uh, people who have actually used the product. Okay, so what this means is, okay, uh, you want to search. Okay, so how how you actually find out, you know, what are you want to find out what are the products that people actually search using does uh, product name work using this search phrase all right so you want to find out what are these products that people actually search for so all you need to do is just to enter does work click on search and look at this all right uh, you see things like does gel uh, whatever it is all right I'm not I have no idea what this is all right but this could be a new product, or it could, it could be a product name, could be a product category, or whatever. But this could be this is how you actually uncover new niches and new products, you know, that you could possibly promote. Okay, not all the results are actually relevant. For example, this is it says how does VOIP work? Uh, it could be a new product idea, or how does a radio work? This is not really uh, relevant. All right, so uh, 
you would actually want to eliminate uh you know all this how does a toilet work okay okay uh let us scroll down a bit um does a penis pump work all right so this itself is a product idea as well right if you were to scroll down okay it does give you uh, a lot more uh ideas all right now um right things like a uh, pro plus pills work the dust pro plus pills work so pro plus pills you know you could do a bit more in-depth research on what pro plus pills are does lexarine really work you know okay so this this how you get uh you know new product ideas now you you might have noticed that um the search results you know ain't that many it's only 80 okay so uh what i realized that okay uh, there are certain ways to, to actually get more results okay so uh for example you could actually just type in uh, a does a work and click on search okay it actually gives you a lot more results you know for what reason i do not know like does H hcg diet work uh, so this is a diet that you could do some research on uh, things like does slim quick really work okay so when just by adding a a it's now giving me 235 results okay and we could add we could try different variations now you just type in a uh, replace it with a b instead Okay, uh, again, this gives you a whole set of different results. Okay, uh, look at this. Does that be gone really work? Uh, all right. So, uh, if you know every single alphabet that you type in here, it will actually give you uh, different results. Okay, uh, you could actually you know just click on the check box over here and download the entire uh, list. Right, so uh, alternatively, you could add in the word "really does." So what you're trying to search for is uh, people who actually type in "does product name really work," okay? And this will give you a whole set of different results as well. Okay, this does health trim really work? Does Synergyn really work? You know, does uh, uh, Liparexel really work? So these are all uh, product ideas that you know you could um, do a deeper search on now let me just give you a few more ideas okay the thing is you really need to uh, go into the minds of uh, these consumers all right so what are some of the keywords that uh, search phrases that you know uh, they could type in and search for on google.com when they are thinking of buying a product let's say um, they want to buy uh, a blender all right so they could type in where to buy a blender for example all right so the thing the key search phrase that you want to keep is where to buy this is honestly a gold mine because if someone were to type in where to buy a product name means that what could it mean it just means that they really want to buy that product right so just type in where to buy and click on the search button All right and let's take a look uh, how many results we have here we have a total of 157 results okay so again uh, it says here pepper spray where to buy so you know that you know pepper spray could be a niche that you go into where to buy dry ice you know um, where to buy gold <laughs> okay so uh, gives you a lot of product ideas buy tremodol online okay so this is a product that people actually want to buy online buy uh, Cinex buy if online is I have absolutely no idea what are all this stuff right but uh, you get an idea you could also use where to purchase okay so this will give you a whole list of uh, product ideas once again okay that's all for this video. I really hope that uh, this will help you a lot. All right, and uh, all the best for for your market and product research.